Samuel, you cannot be eating just anyhow. You need to watch what you put in your mouth. My friend, are you not a Christian? Have you not read the book of Mark, chapter 16, verses 17 and 18, which says, And these signs shall follow them that believe. In my name shall they cast out devils. They shall speak with new tongues. They shall take up serpents. And if they drink any deadly thing, it shall not hurt them. They shall lay hands on the sick, and they shall recover. Even if I drink poison, it can never hurt me. So, what are you now talking about? No Samuel, don't be ignorant of the understanding of the word of God. When the Lord said that we shall drink deadly things, and shall not get hurt. He doesn't order you to start eating just anything you see, in the sense that you cannot get hurt. It can even lead to tempting God. Remember Jesus, when he was tempted of the devil. And, devil, saith unto him, If thou be the Son of God, cast thyself down, for it is written, He shall give his angels charge concerning thee, and in their hands they shall bear thee up, lest at any time thou dash thy foot against a stone. Jesus said unto him, It is written again, Thou shalt not tempt the Lord thy God. You cannot get hurt if you consume deadly things unknowingly, or if there is no way out, not intentionally. God is so good so good unto us. Although the Bible is not a textbook on nutrition, the dietary laws God gave to the Israelite, through Moses, in Leviticus chapter 11 and Deuteronomy chapter 14 shows that God is interested in the food we eat, and our overall well-being. One of the reasons God gave those laws was to shield them from certain diseases. As a Christian living in a world distressed by numerous diseases and infections, you need to pay close attention to what you eat and how you eat because your health is directly determined by what you eat. If you are to be effective in carrying out your responsibility as a mother, father, son, daughter, and Christian worker, or an evangelist, then you should be mindful of what goes into your body, which is the temple of God. Thank you. See you in the next video. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like and share. Also drop your comment, and if you've not subscribed, please do so and turn up the notification bell, so that once we drop new content, YouTube will let you know. Thank you. God bless you. And don't forget that, Jesus loves you.